when the people in power, the establishment, the government and the administration don't step up their plate and when don't show up and don't do their part, it's, it, it is the responsibility of the citizens of the nation and the universe to show up. Three of masks here are partially donated by uh, the fashion designer Pravo Gorek. I wanted to make sure that I was able to bring those and donate it to the hospitals in the marginalized communities. We donated to hospitals in Queens, East Harlem, and in Brooklyn, especially because these were the you know hospitals in the marginalized communities and affected deeply there. You know, and not only were we able to donate, it was confirmed through the doctors themselves from the emails and messages that they sent to us that they were actually being used and not you know, just um, sitting in a stock room. I'm a fashion designer, but I'm also a concerned citizen, you know, um, who, who believes that the, the global ecosystem depends on survival of different kinds of people and, it can, and not just the handful of people who have the access and privilege. That to me is the silver lining in this current situation because at the end of the day, as creative people, as fashion designers, creative peoples, we are storytellers and storytellers are healers. And we've realized now in this particular moment, art, you know, is the best friend that we have looked for. What I really like about this, especially the A100 list, is there are leaders and achievers and you know successful stories, not just based on finances, based on impact. Like, and success necessarily doesn't have monetary value attached to it. Um, I think it's extremely important for the world to know that the leadership happens in different shapes and sizes in, in different forms. And also our contribution to the culture and the society in America and globally is pretty immense.